Hi, my name is Ben. I'm here on behalf of Nitro Network to bring you up to date tutorials of the features that you can find on Nitro Panel. So in today's episode we're going to be checking out how to change the MOTD or the message of the day. So the message of the day is the writing based on your server. Um, when people type in the server IP uh, it will be the set writing that will appear underneath uh, what you've called um, your server on uh, server name. Um, so we're just going to go over how to change that today. So the default will be a Minecraft server, but you can change that and put it in different colours, fonts, you can make it italic, you can make it bold. Um, basically anything you like really. Uh, so first of all, what you want to do is go over to nitropanel.com. Oh, we did .com, but we mean .com. Then choose a server which you will would like to change the colour of the MOTD and then simply click on file manager scroll down and click server properties uh, you can right click it and you can download it to your system and then edit it from there and re-upload it or you can use Nitro Panel's built-in text editor just right click and click edit and we'll just let that load, I'm just going to pull up the codes, so I'll put the codes on the screen now of what um, what each code is, what colour it is, and so on. But if you scroll to the bottom here, you want to find MOTD. It should be second from the bottom. We'll just highlight that and delete it. Now, if we wanted to call our server Nigus Networks, um, we're going to look on the colour, the, the colours uh, for the um, the colour codes, and then for the code for the nearest blue is. U zero zero uh, A seventy nine. But you also want to make sure you've got. Uh, oh, that's in the wrong one. You want to make sure you've got that slash. It's not um, the backslash. It's sort of like a forward slash. Um, uh, so that's your color code there. So if we put nitrous networks there and click save and edit uh, save edit sorry and then restart the server let's just wait for the confirmation that the servers restart uh, the colour should have changed so we just wait for it to say done here we go and let's refresh and as you can see it is in the nitrous networks blue so on Whenever someone types in the IP, that is what they'll see. That message is what they'll see. Obviously, they type in whatever they want at the top, but this is what they'll see. So maybe you could put, like for my server, I'll put Simple MCraft 5.0 because it is version 5 of the server. Um, but you could put something in brackets next to it. Let's put something like uh, if the server was to have a creative world and we use Plot Me. If we just take a look at how to put that, we're going to need a white font. Uh, so what we could do next is uh, backslash again, no forward slash, and change it to white. So that is U00 A7F. And let's put in there plot me, which is a plugin where it gives people their own plots on a creative world. I'll go over that in another video. We'll do we'll do a plugin series of some great plugins for Nitrous Network servers. So I've just restarted that. It's restarting now. If we click refresh, as you can see, it says Nitrous Networks, then in white plot me and you can it's really easy uh, once you know what you're doing. Um, but if we wanted to put it in uh, underlined uh, if we wanted it all underlined what we would do is then go back to file manager uh, server properties edit that again and at the very start or, or wherever you want it to be underlined say we want we want just plot me to be underlined we type in u00 a7n the a has to be capitals by the way click save edit Go back, restart your server. 
But if you do have Bucket installed, you can just type in in the command box, reload and execute that command, but we only have vanilla installed at the moment. And then when it's reloaded, we can take a look when it says done. Oh, that actually hasn't worked. Uh, I think we didn't put the, we didn't put the backslash in that time. That's probably why. Um, I should go back to server properties. Yeah, we didn't put the uh, the forward slash in. So we click save. Go back to the server. Click restart, and then that should hopefully be up and running. Sorry about that. Just made a little mistake. Once that's done, we can go over, refresh, and as you can see, it hasn't worked. I might have put that code in incorrect. Um, A7, yeah, I think I've put that incorrect. Um, but anyway, that's this is how you uh, change your colour of your text, your message of the day. So I just want to thank you all for watching. Look out for some more videos in the future. We will try and get some um, playlists done such as maybe plugins um, and other like mods maybe. Uh, but thank you all for watching today's video. I hope to see you all in the next video.